What's going on everybody? Jonathan Rayana here. Welcome back to the Passion Bay YouTube channel. In a recent video I made, we talked about the 2003 to 2009, which is the second generation Suzuki SC650, and we did like a model and variation comparison video. We talked about everything from the frame paint color changes, uh, S versus N variations, the handlebar differences, subframe design differences, everything. But one thing I wasn't able to show you in detail was the engine design differences, and that's what we're gonna be talking about today. So as you can see behind me right here, I have two different motors. Uh, one from a 2003 to 2006 model and one from a 2007 to 2009 model. I'm gonna show you guys an up close look at what design uh, change they did and why they did it. And we're also gonna be talking about compatibility as well. So if you guys are on the market for a second generation motor, uh, hopefully this will be able to help you out and point you in the right direction of which motor to go with. So without further ado, let's get today's video started. Alrighty guys, so as you see here in front of me, we have two different Suzuki SU650 engines. Now, both of these engines are generation two motors, but this is a 2003 to 2006 specific motor. And on the right, we have a 2007 to 2009 specific motor. Even at a closer look, these motors look almost identical. And that's because they pretty much are from the bottom end all the way up to the jugs. But the big design differences here are the cylinder heads on each motor. So let's take a closer look at that. So on 2003 to 2006 models, you have a single spark plug design uh, cylinder head on the front and rear. But from 2007 to 2009 models, you have a dual spark plug design where you have your normal spark plug in the middle of the cylinder head and then one also casted into the side of the cylinder head. And that is on both cylinder heads as well. Now, the reason why Suzuki did that dual spark plug design was one, to improve emissions and two, to optimize the combustion to help you burn your fuel a lot more efficiently. So that's pretty much it. But in my opinion, I really think that this secondary spark plug design actually helped fix one of Suzuki SV650's biggest problems, which was on these motors where if your front spark plug actually got uh, corroded with water because moisture would sometimes seep past the spark plug boot, it would cause your motor to run on one cylinder, thus rendering it a 325 and uh, a bad ride home. But this motor right here, let's just say you had some moisture go into your front spark plug tube. This one right here still acts as your main spark plug and your engine would run still as smooth as it would even without this one spark plug firing. So I think that's a very, very, very good design and uh, I think it actually helped one of their design flaws. Now, when it comes down to compatibility on both of these engines, uh, it's pretty simple. 2003 to 2006 motors stay in 2003 to 2006s and do not go in 07 to 09s. And 07 to 09 motors can actually fit in 03 to 06s. The only thing is, is that you're gonna have this one spark plug here that's not in use, or you can actually just put a bolt there if you don't wanna see a secondary spark plug there. But this motor will uh, work just the same in 03 to 06 models. Now, the reason why you cannot put an 03 to 06 motor in an 07 to 09 is because the ECUs. Now, this ECU right here is a 2003 to 2006 ECU. It has a single plug and obviously with ECU changes, it would be uh, including uh, wiring harness changes as well. So this right here, you can use this on this motor and you can also use it on this motor. Like I said, you just won't be having that spark plug there. But on later models like these ones over here, you have a dual plug ECU for the dual plug engine. I'm, I'm not really sure that that actually correlates anything with the dual plug, but I just know for a fact though that the 0709 ECUs both have a dual plug. And uh, like I said, that, that entails a wiring harness change on this bike as well. And um, if you had this engine and this motor right here, the ECU is gonna be searching for that secondary spark plug and it's not gonna be there. So I don't believe that your motor will be running right. Don't quote me on that. I've never actually done the swap before, but I don't believe that that is a direct swap for the 03 to 06 models. So that's pretty much it. Oh, also one more thing. In a previous video I made, we talked about uh, maintaining your drain holes on these bikes. Now on the single spark plug design, you see that there's a drain hole right here. And on this one, you don't see a drain hole, but if you actually take a closer look, right down the side of the spark plug right there is your drain hole in there. So what you're gonna have to do is, uh, you'll actually have to remove your spark plugs just to maintain your uh, drain hole and clean that out. But other than that, it's really not too difficult of a job to do. So anyway, guys, it's like a thousand degrees here in Florida. I am dripping sweat right now. So I hope you learned something from this video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. If you uh, wanna continue watching great SV content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for future content. And until the next one, I'll see you then. Peace.